With Taiwan's goal of becoming a bilingual country by 2030, its outlying islands, such as Jingmen, are working hard to promote bilingual education. Schools in Jingmen are utilizing technology, interactive games, and even an English village to improve students' English proficiency. For most of the news, reporter Stephanie Yang flew to the outlying county to give us a look at its thriving bilingual program. This school in Jingmen is equipped with an English village. Students and teachers can role-play scenarios in the village. Students role-play a wartime scenario with their teachers. This is a role-play academy organized by the Jingmen County government. Every semester, fifth graders in the county will gather at Jinghu Elementary School to take a two-day immersive English course taught by a foreign teacher and a local teacher. We are currently integrating English teaching with international education. On the one hand, we integrate some immersive English to connect them with international issues. In the future, when we plan international exchanges, the students can better introduce it to others. At Hupu Elementary School, the foreign teachers teach English class by engaging students with interactive games, question and answer format, body movements, and picture cards. There are currently three foreign teachers in Hupu Elementary School. There are 10 English classes per week. English classes include natural science and art and crafts. Students are also matched with a pen pal from other countries. I have an Australian pen pal. When the pen pal sends a letter, the teacher will let us read the letter. We can learn English vocabulary. We will talk about life, like, for example, their graduation trip. I feel that learning English at school is very rewarding. We can learn grammar and vocabulary while talking to foreign teachers. Or in English, very good, Spain. So what do students do after school? So, cover spot writing. Alir Yu Junior High School, a Filipino teacher, teaches students the cultures and customs of different countries. The school focuses on promoting international education, hoping to improve students' motivation for learning English. In terms of questions and answers, she taught us how to answer questions. I feel like my English is better. Teacher Joy will ask us, how are you? If we feel normal, she told us to say, nothing special. The content of our international education is not limited to English-speaking countries, but also includes countries like Brunei and Tahiti. Although students cannot study abroad this year due to the pandemic, schools are creating innovative ways to raise the level of bilingual education in Jingmen. For most News, Stephanie Yang, Li Jianwei in Jingmen.